Many of us will host family and friends at our homes over the holidays, and you can really make them feel special with just a few simple touches. And Howard Eason from He Designs is here to show us how. Howard, you have great ideas. I love every one of them. <laughs> we'll try to get through Thank all you. ten, but we'll start with, we know that most people travel with their phones, their tablets, their laptops, so we should make it easy for them to be able to use those. Yep, you're exactly right. So why not just frame your password and your network name and just put it beside the bed because everyone has those smartphones and right. iPads and iPods. So yeah. And look how beautiful that is. <laughs> so just a plain old piece of paper, put it in a frame. Absolutely. All right, next, you used to have a suggestion for guests who would rather do without the electronics. Yes, so reading material is very essential. So always have, like, even with crossword puzzles, just do reading materials, magazines, books, and things that you've already read. So just pass it on to the guest room. All right, and the channel guide is essential. I love the way you did this. <laughs> the channel guide, because when people come over, they're not familiar with your, you know, your networks, so you list those, and specifically list the ones that they will enjoy Love and it. just card it out and put it with the remote it's beautiful i've never thought about hallway lighting but that's important oh my gosh it's so important because people don't know i mean if they're the first time visitor they don't know how to get around so mm -hmm. put those little night lights out out so that they have a pathway to the bathroom or even to the kitchen all right and i'll put water on my nightstand every night but i haven't considered <laughs> doing that for my guests yeah yeah i think that you know sometimes you get a little you know your throat gets a little dry during the night so put it in a carafe or a bottle of water is fine so just so that they have it it makes them feel special my mother's coming next week <laughs> and she always forgets a toiletry item it never fails so i might as well just plan ahead yeah just plan ahead <laughs> absolutely absolutely so just to if you know that they like to take baths then do some bath essentials just put it all together package it it'll look really nice and they'll feel very special never seen this one in a guest room was a luggage rack a good idea oh absolutely oh when you have really nice bedding, yeah. people tend to just throw their suitcase right onto your bed. That's that true. always happens. They do. So having a nice luggage rack keeps it kind of um, uh, stationary, and they can always pull just directly from it rather than just pulling it from the bed and, okay. and lugging it around. Flowers always add a nice touch. Oh, flowers, fresh flowers, yeah. So that adds a touch. Everyone likes receiving flowers, so that is always the best touch for a room. And we don't want our guests hunting down the linen closet, so we should provide the towels. Yeah, do the towels, do the full set. So go ahead and have it out and available, and you can even get color towels for each of the guests so that they don't get them confused. Oh, that's you know? Idea. So just go ahead and stack them up and have them out ready, ready and waiting for And them. the classiest of all <laughs> robes for our guests. Oh, robes, yes. Nothing says comfort like robes. So have robes specifically for your guests so that they can kind of lounge around and feel at home. You know, it's a way to make people feel at home. Socks are important as well. I can't believe we got through all 10. Howard, you're amazing. <laughs> and you took all these photos in your guest room. Yes, I did. This is actually um, footage from my house. Yeah. Howard Eason, thank you so much. And Merry Christmas to you. Merry Christmas to you. Yeah. Up next on the scene, a beautiful performance of Christmas music from jazz great Nina Freelon and the John Brown Big Band.